Yo, what's good, YouTube? We got a story time with D Block Dude. Let's hit that. Uh, I hit that sub button. Let's get into the video. Listen. Boy, so boom, right? So boom. <laughs> Boy, so boom. So right? boom. 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 Like the fireworks last in the back. Tuesday. Okay. Last Tuesday, I hit up my tattoo man. I'm like, hey, yeah, you free? Mm -hmm. I need. It. I, I'm trying to finish that tat. Yeah. Cause I'm getting a, I'm getting a uh, tattoo done on my back. But it hurts so bad. I'm not gonna see. I'm not even gonna sit here and count. It hurts so bad that I had to stop and tell him, boy, I will finish it later. <laughs> That's how bad it hurt. So boom, I'm getting a tattoo. It hurt so bad, I say, hey, listen, man, I, I need to got, I got to go to Atlanta. We're going to have to finish this later. Right? He said, all right, boom. Fast forward, Tuesday night here. He said to me, who is that to say, hey. man? Because, hey, bro. So I boom. I want to buy some good yeah. tattoo people in the South Carolina. If so you, hey, hey, hey. Some people in the South Carolina area watching this, Greenville, to be exact. I, don't, I mean, you can just be in that other parts. If you in Greenville and you do some good tattoos, holla at me. Let me know. All right. Anyway, like I was saying. Yeah. Tuesday night, I done hit up my tattoo man like, hey, bro, mm -hmm. you free? I need to get this tat finished. He like, pull up tomorrow at 12. Okay. I'm like, I bet. I hopped off stream. I, done, I hopped off stream. I had a look. Something to do, you know what I'm saying? If you if you know, you know. If you don't, then there ain't none of your business anyway. I had something to do. Yeah. Tuesday night, I'm having a marvelous time. I fall asleep. Set my alarm clock for 9:30 a.m. Set my alarm clock for 9:30 a.m. Wake up. Beep, boom. My alarm clock. You know what I'm saying? I tell my. I say, hey, look, I got I got to do something. You have a good day. And things of this little situation. Boom. I hit the road. I hit the road. I'm in a rental car because I'm I was getting something done to my Jeep. I was getting some LED lights put in my Jeep, under the Jeep, in my in my in the front of my Jeep with a what what a what a headlights at. I hit the road in a rental car. Dodge, it was a challenger, 2022 black challenger. It was a regular, degular, smegler challenger, no 392, no scat, no nothing. Right? So boom. 9.30, appreciate the, uh, appreciate the sub, um, hey, it's, um, appreciate the sub. Anyways, I hit, the, I hit the road at 9.30, I'm on the way back to South Carolina, because that's why I'm getting my tattoo done there, right? I'm listening to that, um, um, uh, uh, about my bread and butter. They keep that nigga listening to Gunner. Hey, that new Gunner album go hard. Don't be sleeping on Gunner, nigga. I don't, don't, really don't, 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 don't know what he did, but that shit go hard. Care. Since it's a rental car and I don't usually drive this car, he's speeding to the who max. Got their license and who be whipping? If you if you used to driving one car, if you used to driving one car, once you get in another car, you're not used to it and you might start going faster than usual. You know what I'm saying? You might start going faster than usual. So, um, you you might you might be going faster than usual if you're not used to driving this type of car. I'm on the highway back to South Carolina. And I ain't gonna lie, I'm going like 90. I, I'm not I'm not knowing. I'm not knowing that I'm going 90 miles per hour. But I see the blue lights behind me. And I ain't even thinking he 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 finna pull me over. So I done pulled over to the right. You know what I'm saying? But he pulled over to the right, right behind me. I'm like. I'm like, so boom. I'm I done pulled over. You know what I'm saying? Put it in part. And he come up to me, he say, You going a little fast, ain't you, buddy? I say, I mean, buddy, I it's lie. crazy. It's a rental car right now, so I'm, I wouldn't really, I was, if I was going fast, I wouldn't, I didn't really notice because I'm not used to driving this car. He chuckled, he let off a little laugh. He say, I understand. Let me get your license real quick, and I'll be nice right cop, back. W cop. I'm like, I right, bet I give him my license. So boom, he back there checking. Yeah, I'm on my phone. I'm on my phone. I'm like, all right. Anyway, that nigga Kyle Loud just said, he back there checking my license. I'm on my phone. I'm on my phone like this right here. Nigga, nigga, I look up. Two more cars pull up. 
Damn. Well, that nigga do, say back I'm up. I'm joking though. <laughs> Listen, I'm joking though. I'm like, I do. Two more calls pulled up, and I'm like, so the dude still back there checking my license. He haven't came back yet, but I guess as soon as he went back there and seen that. You know what I'm saying? It's been white. I had a warrant. To bright, man. Which I never knew I had a warrant. He called the police. The, he called back up and they came. So the two police officers pulled up. I'm like, what I do? They walk up to my car. He tapped my door like that right there. Come on and step out. I'm like, damn. So boom, I get out the car. I get out the car. And this nigga going to say, go ahead and uh, turn around and put your hands behind your back. I say, for what? <laughs> I say for I say for what? I ain't no thug, but I'm like, for what? What I do? He say, um, the, the dude who was running my license, he came out and say, hey buddy, I'm just gonna head let you know, uh, you got a warrant out for your arrest at the city of, of Atlanta. A warrant? Um, so we're gonna Damn. Get you go, go ahead and sit on the what you been right doing? Up. I'm gonna get him a call to see if they want you or not. I say, huh? I say cow. <laughs> on, on my mama, when he said you got a warrant, I said cow. Because that's cap. because I'm a great guy. I don't break the law. I don't do anything that will require me to have a warrant out for my arrest. So I'm thinking like, cow. He said, nah, it's a warrant out for your arrest. I said, for what? I say, what is the warrant for? This nigga said, chat, get what this nigga said. This nigga going to say, a he can run. Who called you that hit and run, dude? <laughs> I say, bro, count, bro. What, bro? I say, bro, that's count. I never hit nobody and ran. I've never, I never got into a wreck and ran. I never got into a wreck ever a day in my life, ever, ever in my life. I've never got in a wreck. So he like, all right, well, I'll be right back. He said, I'll be right back. I'm gonna call him and see if they want us to take him, if they want to come and get you or not. I'm like, all right, bet. I'm sitting right there, got handcuffs on, and the police officer, they like, hey, is there anything in your car that, you know what I'm saying, you need to tell us about, that we need to know about? I say, hell nah. Um, I say, hell nah. He said, you mind if we search it? I say, go right ahead. Now, listen, whole time I'm knowing that if I didn't want them to search my vehicle, they didn't, they was, they couldn't search my vehicle. But I allowed them to search it because I really didn't give a fuck at the time. Hey, look, though. <laughs> hey, look, though. So, boom. It was a black officer standing right beside me. He say, man, please don't run. I say, I'm not going to run, bro. Why the I'm fuck would he run? run? You know what I'm saying? So the white officer, he over there searching my, my vehicle. That's probably a thing you know, that got to tell him, though, because niggas say, probably will run. Happen, happen? <laughs> Big Davidson. Hey, my motherfucker is all right here. Duke Davidson. Hey, look. Hey, look, though. <laughs> Anyways, but it was, hey, I hate hating niggas like you, bro. Mind your business. Just pay attention. Yeah, yeah. Mind your Let business and worry story. about your own self instead of got eaten on another nigga. Hey, look, though. So, boom, right? So, it was a black officer standing right here, right? And a white officer checking my car. He see, he, he check, he going through one of my bags. And he see I got a camera in there. He say, what, you record videos or you take pictures? I say, hell nah. I'm not even telling him what I do because it's none of his business. The black officer say, you do YouTube? He country as hell. He say, you do <laughs> you YouTube? You do YouTube? I say, hell yeah. He say, I knew you, you look familiar. Yeah. He say, I knew you look familiar. You I officer, like, man. Yeah. He say, uh, he say, boy, ain't no way. What did he say? I say, oh, I say, I'm, I'm fake laughing. I'm not going to lie. If y'all ever see this, um, Georgia, uh, how Georgia state, whatever the f y'all call. If y'all ever see this, I apologize. I was fake laughing because I wasn't in the mood to be laughing and making jokes. I'm finna you done pulled me over. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a thug. Somebody bro. got a warrant. So look though, anyways, um, Georgia, yeah, Georgia state patrol. Shout out, to, shout out to them boys. They was actually cool as hell. Anyway, he said, I knew you look familiar. The dude come, the white dude come back. He say, oh, you do YouTube? He asked me all type of questions. How much money you making? You do this. What you doing on YouTube? X, Y, and Z. I'm like, man, bro, I'm just answering the question because I really just don't feel like 
Like, bro, I'm finna go to jail. Why is y'all asking me all these questions? You know what I'm saying? So, boom, they finished. They finished. Um, they finished. Uh, checking my car. They don't pop the trunk, right? They pop the trunk. I ain't gonna lie. I got a whole bunch of designer shoes in there. I got a whole bunch of drip. I just bought some Louis Vuitton pants that cost twenty five hundred dollars. I just bought some shoes. I'm finna take a little IG picture that day. He picking up my pants. He see the price tag. He like, man, God. You know what I'm saying? No flexing. But I'm like, hey, I'm like, hey, yeah. You know what I'm saying? They're like, oh, boy, you ain't getting some money out there, you too. He like, God damn, what? A YouTube pants like this? Shit. Oh, hell you know what yeah. What like I said, I'm really not in the mood to be conversating. I think I'm going to go to jail. So he like, you mind if I check the trunk? I'm like, yeah, go ahead and check it. He checking all the trunk. He checking the trunk and shit. He picked up a pair, a pair of Louis Vuitton shoes and dumped it on the ground. A blunt fell out. Now, listen. <laughs> listen, oh, I do not smoke weed. I, I do not smoke. Don't do drink. Don't do nothing. They, they. However, I let one of my homeboys wear them one day. Hmm. And when he gave them back, I guess he forgot that it was a blunt in there. I, I guess he forgot that he put a blunt in there. So he dumped it on the floor. A blunt came out. He said, mmm, thought you said you don't smoke. I said, I don't smoke. You can do a, 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 a drug test on me right now. I come back, got crystal clean. Piss going to be clean. I don't smoke. I know y'all saying cap in the chat, but that's just what it is. Okay. I swear to God, on my mama, on my hood. I look fly. but I look good. <laughs> I do not smoke. So I'm trying to tell him, I say, I ain't going to count. You got me. <laughs> I'm t but whole time it was my homeboy blunt. He just left it in there. The the, the 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 nigga was so cool though. He say, "Your feet work." I say, "Yeah, but I ain't gonna run." He say, he threw the blunt on the floor. He said, "Go ahead and uh, crush that on. Go ahead and stump on that right there. I, don't, I ain't see nothing." W I was hit that motherfucker like that right there. <laughs> I'm stumping on that motherfucker like this. W <laughs> cop though. I don't. I'm stumping on like that right there. I say. Go ahead. You know what I'm saying? I said, I'm telling you I don't smoke, but I appreciate that right there. You know what I'm saying? W police, W cop. All police ain't bad cops. Yeah, all yeah. It's some good ones out there. Was great guys. Them niggas was fantastic individuals. So, boom. The, 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 the police officer that was running my name, he come back. He say, yeah, they want you. <laughs> I see. Damn. I said, look, I need to call my assistant real quick. Can I call my assistant real quick? He say, I ain't gonna lie. We don't even supposed to... We weren't even supposed to let you use the phone. I'm like, that's cool, that's understandable. You know what I'm saying? Boom. They don't they don't put me in they don't put me in the back of the car. I'm I'm in a K9 unit car. Beside me was a dog, but not directly beside me. They had like a wall. So I only had like this much of space and I'm sitting in Damn. there like this right I had on a, I had on a, I had a room, 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 room. hoodie, some uh stack sweatpants and, and my Rick Owens. Y'all know I love my Rick Owens. So look, y'all know I love my Rick Owens, right? So boom, I'm sitting in the back of the car. He say, "Is any is anything in that car that uh is anything uh valuable in that in your car that you know what I'm saying we need to we need to know about because we we gonna document all the you know what I'm saying valuable." Sh I say, "Hell yeah, my camera and I got a got hundred and fifty thousand dollar chain in there that boy that I that I need to have when I get out." He say, "Okay, glad you said that." I'm finna go get it and I'm gonna bring it to you and put it around your neck so you can go in in jail with it. I say, boy, I appreciate that right there, boy. No cap. <laughs> hey, when you go with some ice on <laughs> this thing, hold up, hold up. That's how they do you. Boy, imagine walking in that bitch, you glistening. You and that bitch. They got y'all hemmed up, boy. You, but that shit on your neck, boy, it's glistening. That's a W cop, but damn, nigga, shit. At least hold it in the car with you. And he put he put the chain on me, and I, you know, what I'm saying he tucked it in for me, and I'm like, I appreciate that. Okay, he tucked you know it in. He put both of my phones. He put both of my phones in um in my my hoodie pocket. I ain't gonna lie, I'm hard headed. I'm a great guy, but I tend to break the rules a little bit. That nigga so listen, got my. I was I was handcuffed like this. He put my phone. 
in my own smart man. My, my hoodie. Um, he hit his pocket. assistant note. Close the door. Man, I don't got. But I don't got. Nigga, that that no, touch just assistant like, like, hey, nigga. I'm arrested. Shit. Word like this, so I'm like this right here, nigga. I'm got. How you doing? Oh yeah, she hit tonight. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen. I'm like this right here. My my wrist hurting like a motherfucker though. Feel me, chat? My my wrist hurting like a motherfucker because I'm I'm having to turn and twist my way around this motherfucker. So I'm like, hey. so boom. I'm like, alright, boom. I don't text. I don't text my D block chat. I said, I'm in jail. <laughs> Boom. I done text my uh my assistant. I done said I'm going to jail. You know what I'm saying? Uh but got when I sent the text, he opened the door and said, Oh, you can't use phones in here. I said, Oh damn, my bad. I was gonna tell my assistant I'm going to jail. He said, Nah, you can't do that. I said, Oh, well here. Boom. He done put it back in my in my um my hoodie pocket. So now I'm like, bro, luckily I got the text off. Boom, he closed it. He said, you good? He done turned the air on for me. I'm like, all right, bet. W you man. I'm in the middle of nowhere, though, chat. I don't even know where I'm at. I'm in some country town. Uh, CJ McCarlin, appreciate the sub. Welcome to D-Block, man. We finna hit 4,000 subs, man. I appreciate it. Hey, if you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you subscribe. We finna hit 600,000 subscribers. Subscribe, like the video, and, and, and comment on the video. I'm like, hey, bro, I, I just subscribed. You know what I'm saying? She like, anyway, look, though. Yeah, we got 20,000 people in here. Y'all heard that, man. We trying to hit 300 subs. So look, 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 look. I don't ask y'all for too much. Just let me know in them comments. When you hit that sub button, be like, hey, Cam. You ain't even got to say who was Cam. Be like, hey, what's up, Cam? I sub. I love y'all forever, man. I'm trying to tell you. I still love y'all forever regardless, but... Hit that so button, dorks. Love y'all niggas. Hey, anyways, boom. We on the way to the uh detention center. I done went back in my pocket. And Being hard-headed again. And I'm I'm trying my best to record a little YouTube video. I ain't gonna lie. I want to I want to upload it on YouTube. I'm trying to record a YouTube video, but my my, my wrist hurting so bad. My wrist hurting so bad. I say, man, f it. this this is exactly what I did. My wrist hurt so bad. I say, I did, I did right here. Man, man that was burning like a mug. Anyway, that shit was burning, bro. Word. So, boom, we get to the jail. We get to the jail and got, boom. I get in there. Chat, listen. I get in there. I got my chain on. I got Supreme. I got grills. You know what I'm saying? And 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 it's a country. Look, look it's a country. Jail, so they had like 20 30 people in the in the front where you, where you sign in it. I knew it was gonna be hella people I'm in like, that motherfucker, right? I'm like, I walk in, it's a it's a big glass door. As soon as I walk in, everybody in the jail can see me, me with a big chain on. I I'm know it hard. I'm trying to look hard, like I don't give a f no. I'm like, this right here. I'm trying to look hard though. Cause there's niggas in there and they see me with this chain and I'm already knowing they got they gonna be looking for some shit. They gonna I'm be on some scheme and shit. So I'm, I'm trying to harm my dude right here. Yep. Boom. He done took the handcuffs off me. I'm doing like this. I'm trying to look cool as hell. You know what I'm saying? Niggas looking at me like this. Like who the fuck is this nigga? Look, look, look. Niggas looking at me like that right there. They like oh shit that nigga that came in with the motherfucking ice bezels watch. Shit time, glistening the teeth. I'm already got it in my head. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna have to get down in here. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna have to get a, get down in here because that's how I, that's how my thought process of jail is. So, boom. He done he done took the chain. Got my wallet. Got both my phones. You know what I'm saying? I did the fingerprint. They 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 <clears throat> they dressed me out. Put me in the orange jumpsuit, mother. And I ain't gonna lie. I wasn't scared. I wasn't scared. I just accepted the fact that I'm finna have to fight. I, I I'm just I'm just accepting the fact that I'm finna have to fight in this month. So, so boom. I Bro, that's one of them situations where you don't want to do that shit, but you like, if I got to. With one nigga so far. 
So and be it, nigga. nigga. was finna get out. I was just coming in, so they put me and him in a little cell. I get in there, he start talking to me. He telling me, you know what I'm saying, he a cool ass nigga. Shout out to you, bro. If you ever see this, I appreciate you for, you know what I'm saying, being cool as hell. Anyways, though, anyways, you know what I'm saying, me and him chopping it up, they were, they take him out my cell, and then they finally take me out, and they send me to the back. Them niggas send me to the back. I'm like, damn. I'm like, man, I won't go home, man. <laughs> I'm like, man, I won't go home. He man. like, you they can't do that. <laughs> I'm like, all right, so boom. They done gave me a little mat. They done gave me a mat, toothbrush, deodorant, soap in a little cup, um, some sheets. Oh, that nigga spending the night. And an orange God damn. washcloth. I walk in there with, I walk, I walk in the back with an old white man. As soon as they open the door, they put me in a bay, in, a, in this little, in this little pod with like 30 niggas. And it, you know what I'm saying? I walk in, I walk in trying to look, trying to look like I ain't scared, bro. I'm trying to look like I ain't no, bro, because I don't want to, you know what I'm saying, give off the impression that I'm a, you feel me? So like, that's that man instinct right there. I walk in, they close the door behind me. That's that nigga, I ain't going to say nigga, that's just that man instinct. At the top, I ain't say nothing to nobody. I don't, I don't walk up there to the, I don't walk up there with my to an open bunk. Put my shit down, sat on the edge of the bed like this right here. I'm like, I'm like, damn. Whole time they had little tablets in there that you can you can text off of, right? You can text off of. Oh, so that's hard. I'm in, I'm in now. I'm in the pod. I'm in the pod waiting on. Now remember, remember, chat. I got a warrant out in Atlanta. I'm in the middle of. Nowhere in West Bumble, in a in some country town, I gotta wait on Atlanta to come and get get me. I'm I was halfway. I was halfway through South. I was halfway to South Carolina when I got pulled over. So now I'm in a country. You know what I'm saying? Country town, and I gotta wait on Atlanta to come and get me, bro. You know what I'm saying? I couldn't bail out though. I couldn't bail out because I had to wait to go to Atlanta to bail out. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know why that was the case, but that was the case, and I, I had to rock with it like so that. They so they took that nigga all the way back so to boom. Atlanta. <clears throat> Damn. I'm like, all right, boom. I get there. Jail up, motherfucker. Over at twelve, I'm in jail by one o'clock. I'm like, all right, bet it's only one o'clock, so Atlanta should be here to get me around four, five o'clock. Cow. <laughs> Man, them motherfuckers didn't come and get me to the next. Boom, Damn, bro. He should have known that. Off, dog. He should have known they didn't that. Get me to the he should have known that. Morning, man. bro. I had to sit in there, nigga. I had to sit in there, bro. So boom. Listen, so boom. I'm in a I'm in I'm in this country tension center just waiting the whole night. Whole time it's so crazy. I'm thinking I'm gonna get out. I'm thinking I'm 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 like I'm sitting here waiting on the I'm staring at the clock. I'm like, oh, okay, boom, it's 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 four thirty. Atlanta should be here any minute to come get me. Oh, damn it's six thirty. Oh, Atlanta should be here in about five minutes. Um, oh, it's eight thirty. Oh, they should be coming, so they should be here. Oh, it's ten thirty. I'm pissed off. Not even gonna count. I'm sitting here staring at the clock for ten hours straight. It's thinking that Atlanta fin Atlanta finna come and get me whole time, nigga. They not even gonna come and get me till in the morning. So boom, I'm sitting there quiet. I'm not talking to nobody. I don't know nobody. I don't want to talk to y'all. I don't want to make no friends. I just want to get out, go home, and take a shower, shave. I feel it. And fuck bitches, bro. That's all I'm thinking about. That makes sense. God. So, so boom, right? Around 9:30 at night. Around 9:30 at night, a nigga looked at me. He said, "You be on TikTok?" I say, "Man, sometimes." Not really. He say, I knew I knew you from somewhere. Now, somebody else heard him ask me that. They're right? like, oh, shit, you don't do this. Like, I don't want to ask you what you know. That is. On they glazed So, about 30 minutes later, I was, sitting on, I was sitting on my bed by myself. A nigga walk up to me, sit on the bed across from me and say, uh, so what you be doing on TikTok? 
I say, man, I don't. My brother, the same shit you and everybody else be doing on TikTok. Dancing, nigga, damn, get the fuck out my face. <laughs> Sometimes I'm I'm capping. I say kinda. Matter of fact, shout, shout out to my dog uh, Lando from the bando. That's the nigga. Shout out to him, free my dog, and shout out to nigga Chris Wilson. This Chris, nigga remember their names? Lando from the bando. Freedom boys out there. Lando you know from saying? the bando. So I'm like, sh kinda. He like so. Sh be doing on there. Me and him in in there chopping it up. Before I knew it, listen. Before I knew it though. I'm in there like this right here. I'm in there like. Damn. Yeah. <sighs> Anyways, man, before I was rudely interrupted, man, I was in there on, sitting on the edge of my bed giving out a whole in YouTube course. I'm in there. I'm hey, and for the y'all, for y'all. Alright, now if y'all see this, the people who he was bunking with, I'm sorry for saying doing this, my nigga in text kicked in, but now I know, if, if, if I went to jail and niggas, and I was in his position, I'd give them niggas a YouTube tutorial too, I'd be like, hey, look, 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 so far, look, nigga, you get you a camera while you in here, film that shit, nigga, give us the behind the scenes type shit. Figure out a way to upload it on YouTube, make your money. And then when you get out, start just vlogging your life from here to there, nigga. There you go. Y'all that's gonna be watching on YouTube, I'm sorry to chat not on the screen right now, man. I don't know how to fix it right now. W Man's on. W Man's on. I know it, it's 10 inmates sitting around me listening to me talk about YouTube. Then they're asking me questions about YouTube. So how much money you done made in one month? Okay, okay, so how much you how much money you done made ever from YouTube? I'm in there I'm in there giving a YouTube class. I'm teaching these niggas how to to do YouTube, bruh. I'm like, bruh, what the fuck? I said I wish I could record this shit, bruh. Cause this shit'd be so crazy, bruh. That's hard me, though. Bruh. I like motherfucker won't even believe me, bruh. But I'm sitting here giving putting these niggas on game about YouTube, social media, being an influencer and shit. They like, so you just make money from living your life? Hell yeah. Crazy. Oh, I guess. Boom. Anyways, fast forward. Fast forward. I end up going to sleep. I end up falling asleep, right? Woke up at 9.30. Woke up at 9.30. Boom. Then woke up at... Damn. The, damn, man. All right, boom. I don't woke up at 9.30, right? Uh, I really had to wake up at 6, 6 o'clock to go eat breakfast, but I just walked down there, got my tray, and gave it to some random nigga. I done gave it to, to, to some random nigga, right? I done went back up there, fell asleep, woke up at 9.30. I done got up, I done got up, walked downstairs, got me a tablet, went back upstairs, I'm texting my assistant. Listen, if my assistant ever sees this, I just want you to know I love you to death. And, I, and I'm grateful and I'm glad that <clears throat> I got you in my corner. Because, like, I really don't even know where I would be, like, in life if it wasn't for you. You know what I'm saying? So, I really just want to... His assistant, like his second mom. But I love you. That's a W you know, assistant right there. Outside, she was outside waiting on me the whole time. Like, everywhere I went, she was there waiting on me. And, goddamn, she the one who made sure that I was all right in there. And, goddamn... So... I do anything. That's a you know job, I'm man. Cause I appreciate shit like that. Like, I appreciate people just having my back. You know what I'm saying? When I need, when I need somebody, like when I need somebody, I just appreciate having somebody. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause I don't really like asking motherfuckers for help. I, I, I feel them. I feel them. It'd be I like that. Kai, Phantom, Asia. I didn't call nobody from D Block. I didn't tell. I didn't call nobody. I only called one person. And the fact that she was there, and, and you know what I'm saying, like. This shit really like not it's not my sister, it's my assistant. <laughs> my assistant, you know what I'm saying? Not my sister. But I mean she like a sister, she like my family, but anyway, so anyway, so boom. 
So goddamn. Boom. I wake up at 9.30. I get on a tablet. I'm texting my assistant. At 10.30, they call me. They say, hey, Dennis, Atlanta here to take you back. I say, thank fucking God. Man, I just been in this bitch all whole day. You know what I'm saying? So, boom, I done gather my items, my things. I done walk down, you know what I'm saying? I done walk downstairs. They done, boom. I done put, put back on my, my Supreme hoodie, you know what I'm saying? Put back on my chain. Put back on my Rickies, my stack, you know what I'm saying? I really had that shit on for real. But they ain't just need to hear them. Boom. I done... The Atlanta police officer that came to get me, he was black. Boom, me and him done got up on out of there. I told y'all I was in the middle of nowhere. It was, a, it was an hour and 30 minutes back to Atlanta. An hour and 30 minutes back to Atlanta. I just came from Atlanta. I had to I had to go back. Hey, look, if y'all want to see my mug shot, if y'all want to see my mug shot, type in Dontavious, De Dontavious Dennis mug shot. And then y'all, you know what I'm saying, y'all going to find me. Anyways, though, so boom, uh, I got in the car, I got in the back of the police car, fell right asleep. I'm on the goddamn, I'm on that bitch slobbing and all, pause, <laughs> pause, <laughs> word. I would've went Look, to sleep too. I done got I down, uh, so boom, I done got down. We stop at the jail. I'm thinking that we at the jail that I'm supposed to be at. No, we going to pick up some other, some other criminals. Not saying that I'm a criminal, but... Nigga! I'd be pissed as hell if I done got arrested. Got out. Got to drive an hour back from where I just came from because I got a warrant there. And your ass playing Uber, why you going to take me the, 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 so I can get out of the shit, nigga? Nigga, drop me out first while you want to play Uber, Mr. Officer. Damn. They, they done got in the car, I ain't gonna lie. Them niggas smelt like ass. Them niggas <laughs> smelt like ass, for real. But I really didn't judge them because they just got out of jail. So I'm like, all right, boom. It took like 15 minutes to get to the next jail, which the, the jail like we was going, I was going in. So boom, we get to the jail, we walk in. Mind you, I got a chain on. I, I really got that shit on. Damn. I don't look like no broke ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, I really got that shit on. I he got do still got that shit on. on. I forgot. I got Rickies, you know what I'm saying? So, so boom, right? I done got down. I done got down. Got out the police car. We I done went to the Atlanta jail. We walk in the Atlanta jail, right? We walk in the Atlanta jail, and as soon as I walk in, the police officer that was checking checking criminals in, checking the prisoners in, he look at me. He say, "Why ain't no way, boy?" <laughs> Duke got motion. He said, "Why ain't no way, boy?" Duke probably like ain't no way to me. me. He say, "She, you got anything on you?" Um. I only see your old mug shot. Hey, listen, chat. It's 23,000 people in here. Hey, listen. Um, if y'all, if people start posting my old mug shot, um, I need y'all niggas to be on defense. Cause y'all know I already cleared that weird ass shit up. So I need y'all, I need y'all niggas to, to really put niggas in their place. That nigga done got arrested you know, twice. Niggas is talking crazy. I need y'all like, I don't ask y'all niggas for much, but I need y'all niggas to put them in their place. No cap. Cause I don't, you know what I'm saying, niggas know. So I appreciate that shit too. Love y'all niggas. Anyway, don't look. Um Damn. So boom, he said, you I ain't even know you. I said, hell yeah, I got my two. It ain't none of my business. I got this big ass chain on. He said, damn. He said, well, I ain't gonna cap. I'ma need you to tuck it. Cause it's some weird ass niggas, it's some crazy ass niggas, some young niggas Respect. I know if they see that, they gonna get they gonna be on some fuck shit. So I'm like, Damn. I'm like, I right, boom. I'm like, I right, boom. I don't tuck, I don't tuck my chain. I don't, I don't tuck my chain underneath my hoodie, underneath the shirt I had under it. And boom, I ain't gonna lie. He said, all right, bro, look, this is what I'm gonna need you to do. I'm gonna need you to go in this room right here, strip, squat, and cough. Wait, so this nigga gotta go to <laughs> wait. 
So this nigga got out of jail and he got to take his ass back to jail again. I thought they cleared the shit up. Damn, this nigga got to go to re re jail. That's some shit, boy. Take off my shirt, take off my pants, my socks. He say, man, pull your drawers down, face the wall, pull your drawers down, bend, squat, cough. I mean, not bend, just squat and cough. I done did it. Who, what, who, what am I going to do, say no? You know what I'm saying? I'm like, what am I going to do? What am I, am I going to say no? No, nigga, I'm in jail. Nigga, I got to do what they tell me to do. So I got them, I squat, hand on my head, I <clears throat> like a fucking cheese head. You know what I'm saying? Get up. But it was quick, though. It was quick, like. It was quick, nigga. Squat, cough, all right, boom. Get up, put your clothes on, goddamn. Come on, put your chain on, everything. I'm like, all right, boom. Nigga, I, I get past that part. I walk in at like 2 o'clock. I get in the jail at, I get in the jail at 2 o'clock. But when I walk in, I see so many niggas. It's literally Hundreds of niggas in this shit. Bro. That nigga in Atlanta it's now. Overpopulated, overcrowded, nigga. Yeah, nigga, this that's nigga century. Bro. That's and the I whole fucking hood. I got this motherfucking chain on. He in the projects. I got grills in my mouth. I'm, I got Ricky's on. I'm already knowing I'm looking like a real lick right now, and I don't like that shit. So, nigga, I'm already, I'm having a mindset like, bro, I'm finna have to goddamn. He in the A with it too. Shit, hell nah. Try me in this bitch, bro. So I'm like, all right, I'm already thinking like, damn, I'm gonna have to get out of one of these right? Boom! <clears throat> I get it, I walk in. God on his side, I feel like. Sit on the and God on his side again, I man. I got in there at 2 o'clock. I didn't get booked in. I didn't get booked in till 11 at, at night. Damn, nigga. I was in there waiting for nine hours before I even got booked in, bro. So, like, I'm like, Damn, bro. I'm like, damn, bro. I'm sitting there waiting for nine hours, bro. Whole time, niggas in here getting the fuck beat out of them. Niggas getting beat up. Niggas getting jumped. Goddamn. Shit. Crackheads in this motherfucker. It smell like shit, piss, ass, armpits, feet, all type of shit. I'm pissed off. I'm going to go home, man. Word, man. I'm going to go home, man. I ain't going to lie. Two, two young niggas, two young niggas beat the fuck out this nigga, bro. Damn. Two young niggas beat the fuck out this one nigga, bro. They done got them nigga. They done leaked the nigga nose and all. I'm looking like man, them the two niggas, and I'm gonna have to watch out for because they done yes, beat Lord. Out this this nigga words. So I'm like, I bet. I'm like, I cool. Hey, hey, we a hundred, we a hundred subs away from four thousand, man. Let's go ahead and hit four thousand subs tonight. Hey, anyway though. So I'm like, all right, boom, I peep. I peep the little light skinned nigga and the little dark skinned nigga. They done, they done, they done got them beat the fuck out of this other nigga. Them the two young niggas I'm gonna have to watch out for, right? I'm like, all right, boom. So meanwhile, between while, I'm waiting to get booked in. Like I say, I didn't get booked in until 11 at night, damn near midnight. I've been sitting around this motherfucker rotting for nine hours straight with nothing moving, nothing changing. I'm pissed off, like I say. That nigga stuck in I'm traffic. Home, man. Like, I'm thinking when I got to Atlanta, I'm finna get bonded out. That's what I, I, I thought. put in the fucking system yet, bro. Hey, look, Fulton County, boy, y'all ain't shit, boy. Cause y'all need to hire some more people. Cause, boy, y'all. That's sad as hell, bro. Cause, like, if you listen to, like, rappers and shit, or just, like, Anything they got to do with people from Atlanta, watch podcasts, they talk about fucking Fulton County, yo ass better I never get arrested in Fulton County, because nigga, eh, some bullshit over there. You stay your ass out of Fulton. I'm glad I learned about Atlanta before I go to Atlanta. That shit don't make no sense how goddamn, man, that shit goddamn don't make no sense, bruh. Word, bruh. Real talk, but anyway, though. So look, I got down, boom. Luckily, luckily, the nigga who said, "Boy, ain't no way, boy." When I first got in there, he fucked with me. So like, he was like, "Hey, shit, look, I'm gonna try to make this shit as simple as I can for you." I know how niggas is. W so officer. Keep you away from shit like that. I'm like, I bet. So, boom, they put me in a cell. No cap, chat. No cap. 
No cap. Hey, appreciate the gifted, though. Appreciate the five gifted anonymous gifter. Thank you for that. Hey, look, no cap. Y'all see how big my room is? Y'all see how big my room is? Cut it in half. Listen, cut my room in half, and that's how big the sale was. Damn. That's how big the sale was. On my mama, on D, on God, nigga. It's 30 motherfuckers. It's 30 motherfuckers in this last space. I couldn't lay down. I couldn't sit down. The floor was dirty. It smelled like feet, piss, shit, ass. It's crackhead sitting here. It's niggas I got to watch out for in here. I can't sit down. Niggas to sit down already. I was standing up for three, four days straight on my mama, nigga. Sometimes when I went, listen, bro. I was standing up, bro. Just like this. Shit me, bro. I got to take a seat. I'm not going to sleep. I'm not. I'm not slipping, bro. Cause I know how niggas is, bro. Word, nigga. I didn't eat in there. I didn't sleep. I didn't drink nothing. Cow. There was cow. Listen, <laughs> look. This is what I did do. So boom. He probably drank some water. It's it's thirty niggas in the cell. It's thirty niggas in the cell. Oh, um, Officer George. Well, I appreciate you, boy. Real talk, Officer George. I'm going to tell y'all one thing. Foreign for County, you ain't shit. Why y'all ain't take the jury out this young man? Why the fuck would you have him in that fucking cell with jury on, my nigga? That, that's fucked up. That's fucked up. Even if, like, even if it was a nigga that pulled up in there with some fake ass chains on, why the fuck would you set any nigga up? To have hella jewels on. I see the grills, but the chain? Why y'all niggas ain't put that shit up? At least give it to his assistant? What the fuck? Hell no. Thank you. Cause every time he'll see me in a cell standing up, I'm I'm looking at the door like this. I'm looking at the door like this right here the whole time, like waiting for these motherfuckers to come get me. Hope hoping that they finna come get me, bruh. Man, y'all spam up W goddamn. Uh, Officer George. In the w chat, Officer man. George, man. Word, bro. Hey, hey, hey. God was on his George, side, man. Listen, bro. Just know they in the chat going crazy. I wish, I wish I had my chat on my screen, but it done fucked up. Anyway, though, listen. I'm at the goddamn. I'm looking out the door right here. I'm dead smack in front of the door, nigga, waiting for somebody to come and get me, bro. Cause I don't like that, bro. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. Anyways, but whenever Officer George would see me in a cell, he'll open up the door and say, hey, come here real quick. And he'll let me go sit out. He'll let me go sit out in the in the common area and I go goddamn sit on the chairs away from everybody. I'm out there by myself. Look though, I'm out there by myself. He'll say, hey man, come on, come out here real quick. He'll let me go sit out there and I'll go to sleep like this right here for about an hour, an hour, 30 minutes, and then one of the one of the other officers who wasn't who wasn't put on game, they're like, "Hey, what you doing out here? Uh, uh, go get back in the cell." I'm like, Boom! This shit was pissing me off, bro. You know what I'm saying? But every time he 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 came back and he seen me, he was like, "Hey, come up here, he'll try to get me out." Good thing is, I was getting like an hour of sleep. Bad thing is, he had to get out work. So whenever he was off work, I didn't get that luxury. Like I didn't get, I like no, none, none of the other officers fucking with me like that. Like none of them knew who I was. George a W so officer, man. Y'all know, I, know I, don't, I don't use that car like I'm somebody. Like I don't think I'm somebody. I just be doing me. I stay in my own lane, yeah. my own business. He just you know himself, man. Don't mind me, my name dude. And then, ah! hey, listen though. Listen, I never, I never. Assume niggas fuck with me or know who I am. I just be goddamn moving. It's respect though. So goddamn. So whenever Officer George was off work, I had to sit in the cell with thirty other <laughs> other niggas. I didn't, man. Listen, I didn't eat nothing. They gave me. They was they was handing out motherfucking sandwiches. sandwiches. Hell yeah. Goddamn. And water and shit. I didn't drink none of the water. I didn't drink. I didn't eat none of the bologna sandwiches. It's niggas in here, goddamn. I'm watching these niggas. These niggas is devouring these bologna sandwiches. Eating that fucking food. Word. They eating the fuck out of these bologna sandwiches, nigga. 
Man, listen, bro. It was a nigga in there with, that, that was off goddamn everything. He, he off crack, meth, weed, fentanyl, perks, pills. Man, that nigga is off everything, man. That nigga was a real deal junkie, bro. That nigga Shit. Had that goddamn black in feet. me. Not like my feet, nigga. Black feet like he been in the streets for goddamn six months straight. No showers feet like. I'm looking at this nigga like, boy, ain't no more fucking way, boy. I can smell you from here. And this nigga was in my cell, man. This nigga got damn up. I'm telling you, bro. We in that motherfucker 30 deep, bro, in a little ass box, bro. And the motherfucking toilet was in the back. And got he damn shit, he was in there peeing while 30 niggas in there. And got damn, man, on, on my mama, nigga. The, the junkie nigga, the junkie nigga was sleeping right next to the toilet. Nasty nigga. I say, man, I won't go home, man. <laughs> I say, y'all niggas too, y'all niggas some goons in this bitch. I won't go home, man. Word. Somebody bro. playing with this, this nigga, nigga door. Sleeping right next to the toilet. Niggas is stepping over this nigga, peeing and shit, dick out over this nigga. This nigga sitting, this nigga laying right next, next to the toilet, bro. I say, man, I won't go home, man. This niggas in here got them smelling like straight assholes and elbows, man. Got them, they smell like arms. It's niggas laying, you can't even walk on the floor. It's niggas laying all on the floor and shit. I'm standing up, man. I want to go home, man. On D, bro. Crazy shit, crazy shit, though. Like I said, bro, I didn't eat nothing they gave me, bro. Only time I was eating, when Officer George was let, would let me out to go sit on the chairs, it was a vending machine with a... With a Georgia bomb something? And some snack vending machine. Had my wallet, y'all know me. Oh. I had my wallet. Man, I went in there and fucked that vending machine up. This honey bun, sneaker bar, candy bar, tiny chips. Got them. They skills. had this nigga wallet on him. Yo, that's fucked up for us. Got them orange feather. Man, I'm in that motherfucker. Motherfuckers is looking out the window, looking at me. I'm in that bitch swiping the fuck out my car. Yeah, damn damn right. I only got an hour. Man, I'm goddamn swiping that motherfucker. Yeah, damn man, right. Goddamn, man, real talk, nigga. I came in with a little 17-year-old nigga. Little hard head, you know what I'm saying? Little hard head nigga. Little 17-year-old. He, he done said, hey, bro, you gonna fuck with me on a, on a bag of chips and a soda? I said, little nigga, I got you. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Game for you. I'm eating, I'm eating, punishing the fuck out the little goddamn honey buns and shit like that. Boom. They done sent me back in there. But I'm cool now. I'm cool now, cause shit, bro, I just got them. The nigga just had a feast. A I ain't gotta eat none of them nasty ass bologna sandwiches. And none of them nasty ass got them, drink none of that nasty ass water. You know what I'm saying? Now listen, bro, back to the junkie, bro. Back to this motherfucking junkie, bro. Whole time, whole time, bro, this nigga, I'm looking at this nigga like, ugh, bro. I'm like, bro. Ooh, I'm looking at this nigga, man. This nigga got a dirty ass t-shirt. This nigga got some dirty ass pants, but his pants is right here to his knees. And his boxes is dirty with black ass feet. I say, ooh, bruh. I say, man, I won't go home, man. Crazy shit I seen this nigga do, right? Boom, I told y'all this nigga had his spot where the toilet Nasty was. Nasty ass, man. He would sleep where the toilet was at. These is the dirtiest flows, dirtiest walls I ever seen in my life, bro. Right? I'm like, all right, boom. I'm like, all right, boom. The nigga, they, they done came in, they passing out bologna sandwiches. Two, two, two bologna sandwiches come in one pack. They passing out bologna sandwiches. Here, here, here. Nigga, the, 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 the junkie in the back, the junkie in the back, nigga, with a toilet at. Eating his bologna sandwich, nigga. He done put it on the floor. Nasty motherfucker. This nigga, man, I ain't listen, listen, God, I apologize. I'm judging like a motherfucker. But man, I say, man, this nigga is a goon. This nigga is a motherfucker. Uh, yeah. This he nigga, outside for real. Hell, man. He 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 eating the bologna sandwich off the floor. And he eating this shit so weird. He eating it so weird, bro. The nigga is. Bro, he not eating a sandwich like this right here, bro. The nigga is eating a sandwich like he got the sandwich on the floor right here. He taking the top bread off and he eating it like this right here. I say, man, there ain't no motherfucking way this nigga eating a sandwich like that. He tripping. I say, man, I want to go home, man. This nigga, bro, he, this nigga going to pick the top of the bread up like this 
and got them eating like this. He looking crazy as hell. Then he took the cheese off. He taking the shits off one by one and eating it like that right there. I'm standing at this nigga like. You know he ain't Bruh. eating shit, he done, dude. He, done, he done took the cheese off. That's his dinner. Like, that's his. That's what he, he in there for. He took the pony off and he, he, he eating all of it one by one. I said, man, I'm going to go home. He ain't there to eat. Bruh, this nigga is a gangster, man. I say, bruh, this shit ain't for humans, bruh. That, that, that shit ain't for human beings. Hell no, nah, it's not for human You see bro, some people I love to so live in that bitch. Enemy, bro. So boom. Like I said. It's probably I'm some niggas up, watching I, us that's in that motherfucker. Salute to y'all Thursday, that want to be in that bitch. I couldn't. Hell no. Nah. Wednesday morning. Thursday I get to Atlanta, right? So boom. Friday. Mind you, I'm not sleeping, bro. I'm not sleeping. I'm standing up, but my back is burning, bro. My back is burning, bro. No cap, nigga. The only time I'm sitting down, bro. Listen, I'm standing up. I gotta be on all ten, bro, because I'm paranoid as hell. I'm thinking one of these niggas finna try to goddamn beat me up while I'm asleep. My back is. He burning, got on jury bro. too. No cap. I'm standing up for goddamn fifteen hours a day, bro. Like this right here, niggas staring out the window, staring out the door, hoping goddamn they finna come and say, "Hey, Dennis, you finna go home, bro." But I can't even think like that because I haven't even went to court yet. I haven't even seen the judge yet. So I'm standing up the whole time. Every three, four hours, I do like this right here. I sit down on the floor like this, bend my, you know what I'm saying, and stretch, do some shit like that. Get right back up, nigga. I know Word, this nigga chain down, was. <laughs> That was probably like, what the fuck? Being able to get <laughs> so shit, he in there with some Atlanta <laughs> niggas too. Young niggas at that. Get shipped to Atlanta Thursday morning. I'm waiting in Atlanta the whole Thursday. I know some of them niggas in there know who, know who he is. At night. So I'm in there for a whole day for no reason. Boom. Next morning, next afternoon at 2 in the afternoon, bro. Friday, 2 in the afternoon, I finally get to see the judge. Finally get to see the judge. Now listen, niggas go off vibes, bro. Like niggas, niggas can see cool niggas, bro. Like I promise you, bro. Vibes is a real thing, bro. Like the way you carry yourself, and like, like the way you carry yourself. That's facts. You present yourself, the way you stand, the way you talk, the way you look. All of that shit matter, bro. Especially goddamn. You know what I'm saying? You gotta respect yourself and, and, and everybody around you at all times, bro. No cap, because like the shit say a lot, your demeanor, the way you look at niggas, all that shit matters, bro. Cause I I swear to you, the whole time I was That's there, facts. Hey one nigga He ain't lying, bro. The way you carry yourself, bro, the way you talk, the way you look, your demeanor. People uh people will Look at you based off a lot of that. If you look at angry people, gonna be like, "Oh shit, this nigga probably mean as fuck." Let me. If you cool as fuck and you just smile, yeah, hey, how you doing? They go, "Hey, how you doing?" They go off your attitude. What I'm trying to tell you. Just said nothing out. That's true. Way. Your attitude will carry a lot of weight. Looked at me weird. Not a single nigga said nothing out the way to me. No nigga, and I'm not saying that I'm that I'm not fuck withable. I'm just saying like it had to be my vibe and like how I present myself and shit because niggas was, niggas was in there getting beat up, bro. Yeah. For no reason, bro. Niggas could have easily tried me on some shit like nigga, who the fuck, who the fuck you think you to something? Nigga could have really tried me, and I would have had to get down. I would have had to goddamn. Stand on all ten by myself, cause I'm in there by myself. I don't got nobody with me. I'm in there dolo, nigga. I ain't got no D block members, no 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 nothing. I ain't got that fire on me. I I'm in there by myself. So in, a nigga could have tried me at any time, but nobody did. And I'm really thankful for that, cause I really what didn't want to have to goddamn get into it with no nigga just cause. You know what I'm saying? So like. So boom, Friday afternoon, I go to court. Whole time, 
I had met a nigga in there. I had I had met a few niggas in there who I had started communicating with, started talking with, just off the strength. Like I don't know what it was, but me and one nigga clicked, bro. Shout out my nigga, you know what I'm saying? Shout out my nigga Two Chopper, man. Listen, yeah, he got some people well, in there, man. He got some connections. Got out, but shout out my nigga Two Chopper, you know what I'm saying? One K, you know what I'm saying? Cause boy, that nigga just came home from prison, bro. <laughs> The nigga just came home from prison. And goddamn me, I had met the nigga, me and the nigga in there chopping it up. He was the, really the only nigga that I was talking to in there. You know what I'm saying? Like, me and the nigga in there talking about bitches and goddamn what we was doing when we was out. I'm sitting there talking like I've been in jail for goddamn four years. The whole time I've been in that bitch for 56 hours. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, but 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 still though we got them chopping it up and shit. L ass, my bad, bro. My bad. It ain't me though. Y'all see, I'm I'm right here. Anyways though. Anyways, so <clears throat> so boom, right? Friday at two o'clock, I go to court. Right? Whole time, mind you, I never knew what I'm in jail for. I, I I'm not knowing. <laughs> They popping fireworks again, chill. Y'all niggas just got the house. I'm not Ooh. doing why I'm in jail, though, chat. So I'm thinking, like, bro, why the fuck am I in here? Motherfuckers ask me, bro, why the fuck is you in jail, bro? I'm saying, hell, I don't know. Whole time, everybody asked me, hey, what you in here for? I'm like, I don't need no, bro. <laughs> Whole time. So, boom, I finally go to court. I finally go see the judge. And the nigga finally... Tell me what I'm in jail for. And I can't say it right now. But just know, I say, man, ain't no motherfucker. It was some bullshit. Me and my lawyer, I'm the only nigga in here with a lawyer, bro. Shout out to my assistant. Like I said, once again. W assistant, man. With a lawyer, bro. Me and my lawyer sitting in front of the, in front of the judge, bro. The, the judge finally tell me what I'm in here for. I can't say it right now. I say, bro, ain't no motherfucking way, bro. I say, ain't no motherfucking way, bro. Anyways, to sum it up, <clears throat> to sum this whole thing up, I done got down. I get out of court. I finally get a... Anyways, though, like I was saying, though, chat. Back, let me finish my little jail story time, though, before I was rudely interrupted. So, boom. Long story short, let me speed this up. So, boom, Friday morning, Friday afternoon, I go to court. They tell me what the fuck happened. I say, man, ain't no motherfucking way. You know what I'm saying? I leave court at like 2.30. Leave court at 2.30, bro. Go back to the cell. I'm waiting from 2.30 in the afternoon to 6 in the morning the next day. Day, this nigga done been in there for I don't get out. some I don't days. Get out. Damn, we hit four thousand sub, nigga. Yo, what so, the fuck? Man. Big four K to check, nigga. Big four K to hey. check. Appreciate everybody who. So basically, that nigga was in there. Cause you know, if you go in on the weekend, you can't get out till that Monday. But goddamn, but uh, so he was in there for that extra weekend and shit. What's up, man? Welcome to D Block, bro. Love y'all, nigga, man. You know what I'm saying? Real talk. Anyway, though. Basically, got them. Damn, appreciate that, man. 4K in the chat, man. Damn, amazing viral. Appreciate the 25 gifted, bro. I don't know who you is, but thank you, nigga. Welcome to D Block, man. Everybody who got gifted, welcome to D Block. Basically, bro, got them. I probably left out a whole part, bunch of parts and shit. But basically, bro, I got out. I got out of jail at 6 30 Saturday morning. Oh, he bro. got out Saturday, dude. And I don't wish that shit on my worst nightmare, bro. Hell my worst no. Thing, bro. Like, I ain't dude, never listen. trying to see them parts. Hopefully, I don't. Man, that shit ain't no place for human beings, bro. That shit is no place for human beings, bro. And the whole time, let me tell you, it was a police in there that looked like Russell Wilson. <laughs> I would have been like, what's up, Officer Russell? Like, like Russell Wilson. And. What a Russell like, like Shaq in here, Officer on the low. It was a little light skinned, little desk worker in there. I ain't gonna count. She was you fine. see this? DM me. Listen, it was a little light skinned little worker in there. You know what I'm saying? Hey, like, don't women that work at, you know in prisons like, and in jail and all that. Uh, Alley Supremacy. 
It was a convention. In there chat. Listen, I mean, detention so center. You know what I'm trying to say, but I they be like, fine. Y'all be fine. Boom. I see her. I had to go talk to her in order to get booked in. But after that, every time I seen her, she was looking at me. So I'm like, damn, I'm in here trying to goddamn. I'm Riz. focused on the wrong shit. I see this little light skin, little yeah, I'm all right. I'm all right, bet. Every time she see me, though, she looking at me. Damn, she looking at me. I'm in jail. Though. She still looking at me. Like, I would have been like, when they when they checked oh, me out, I would have been like, damn, check, check that system, get my L-A-L. number. Boop, boop, boop. Hey, appreciate the team. Hey, yo. Big So look, though, check. Boom, every time she walked past, she looking at me. She smiling. She had a big forehead, though, but that don't matter. I love, I love women with big foreheads. Ain't nothing so wrong with that, man. Right? Boom. The last day I was in there, this is what really made me feel like, like, you know what I'm saying? That I could converse with her. Check. Tell me what y'all think, right? I might be over. Well, every day what y'all think, right? She walking past, and every time I look at it, I'm looking at her, she like, what you want? Like, she like, what you want? That's what she's saying. I'm like, damn, I know, I know that tone. You feel me? I'm like, I know that tone. You know what I'm saying? She like, what you want? You don't Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Oh, she wanted them. She wanted them. She wanted them. She gonna give you the pussy, and then she gonna go get you some snacks. She gonna sneak you some phone in there. She gonna sneak you some drugs in there. She gonna sneak you the Papa Jazz. She wanted them, but you gotta have some motion though. You gotta only have motion. See, he went in there with the jewels on. So, oh, nothing. Boom. 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 Whole time I was really Zoom, finna ask Zoom, 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 Zoom. I was, chat, listen. I was finna ask, I was finna say, so she like, are you allowed to like talk to inmates? <laughs> I was finna ask the damn baby, I would are you allowed this shit. to talk to inmates? Like, will you lose your job if I was to like if you was to give me your number or some shit? Like, where? Cause like, you know what I'm saying? She kept she she was saying, like, you know what like what you looking at? Like I'm like, damn, like, I ain't really see you huh? tell nobody else that. You know what I'm saying? So listen, light-skinned girl from the from the book in, if you see this. From the book in. Go ahead and hit me up, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Maybe we can go get dinner or something. <laughs> dinner or <laughs> something. Go get dinner or, like, you know what I'm saying? But look, though. Hey, look, though. Last thing. Last thing. So, boom. Friday, after I got out of court, I'm waiting to get called out to go to leave to leave jail shout out to the lady but at the same time i hate you because like the lady that was getting people out of jail the, that, that was coming to get people to release people right she got down she got down i was watching her bro. i was looking out the door the whole time i'm looking at her i know you're gonna see this but i don't even care Chat, I watched this lady, bro. I'm thinking I'm finna get out of jail Friday, bro. Around nine, around 10 o'clock at night, I start watching her. Around 10 o'clock at night, I start watching this lady, bro. The lady that released prisoners, I start watching at 10.30 at night. When I tell you I watched this lady for four hours straight, I watched this lady for four hours straight, chat. And the whole time, she doing like this right here. She patting the fuck out of her. That weed the it, itching. Weed was itching. She doing this right here. For four fucking hours. I'm sitting here waiting for this motherfucker to come and get me, bruh. And release me, bruh. Whole time she... I say, man, ain't no motherfucking way, bruh. And, and around like 4.30 in the morning, I gave up. I said, man, I ain't watching this bitch no more, man. Word, man, I ain't watching this bitch no more, man. I, man, I've been watching this motherfucker for goddamn four, five hours straight. I ain't watching her no more, man. Real talk, bro. Shit, bro. I got out 6.30 in the morning. Hey, we funny as hell. Us buy, niggas funny, see, I had bro. to go buy two brand new phones, bro. Look at these. These are brand new iPhone 14 Pro Maxes, bro. I had to go buy two of them, bro. Because they took my phone, and then, goddamn, they took my phone, and then... They took it somewhere else. So when I tried to go get my what phone, the man, they told me out. We don't, we not open until Wednesday because it's 4th of July weekend. That nigga about to have four phones. Bitch, what the fuck are you talking about, bro? 
You 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 expect for me to go phoneless for six days? Say less. Say less. 